All right, so my first question for you today is how do you think your presentation went? Um, I think it went pretty good. I um, did go a little bit fast. It's usually what happens when I'm like nervous and stuff, but I think overall it was pretty smooth. Awesome. Was there any like thing in particular that you wanted to highlight from your presentation you think it's important we know? Um, not that I can think of right now. Okay. Um, so you did a travel blog, mm -hmm. and I think a question I've kept bothering you about is like, where are you going to go next? Like, what plans do you have for the blog? Like, what places are you going to add to it? Do you have any plans for the immediate future? Um, not quite immediate. I mean, one of the things that I um, mentioned is that I um, featured like one place that I wanted to go to in the future, which is Spain. And so, I mean, I don't think that's going to happen right now, obviously, but um, I hopefully in the future I can go there and share my experiences. Cool. And what kind of audience is your blog for? Is it for like friends and family or do you want to reach like a broader audience with it? Uh, I mean, friends and family and also just people who like to like explore and do things like that. Awesome. Um, and part of it, you mentioned learning how to do HTML and then how to format using CSS. Mm -hmm. um, so what are some big like learning experiences you got from that? Um, I learned that you have to have a lot of patience because it can be really frustrating when like there's a problem with your code but you don't know what it is. It could be like as simple as a semicolon and like that's what's causing the whole thing to be all bugged. So, um, do you see yourself doing any coding projects in the future? Uh, definitely, I definitely want to. Uh, some of my sisters have done things with coding, and I think that'd be really cool to follow in their footsteps. Awesome. Um, well, my last question for you is, do you have any advice for anyone attempting a similar project or being in a mentorship program like this? Um, yeah, like I said, have patience and don't give up because eventually you can get it all figured out. Awesome. Thanks. Well, one last thing is we have a certificate of achievement for you Thank for your you. participation this year. Um, thanks for being part of our um, first year Thank at Ann Richards, so and I appreciate all that you've worked on this year. Thank thanks. you.